गरेर स्तनलाई ठीक स्थानमा व्यवस्थित गरिदिन्छ त्यसैले यो तपाईको लागि दिन वा रातको बेस्ट फ्रेन्ड हुन सक्छ स्काई सोको एयर ब्रा बिजनेस लीडर एयर होस्टेज प्रोग्राम अनाउन्सर न्यूज रीडर मोडल नायिका कर्मचारी देखि विद्यार्थी एवं गृहिणीहरुका लागि आवश्यक मात्रै हैन अपरिहार्य पनि छ स्काई सोको आधुनिक एयर ब्रा स्किन मेड ब्ल्याक र सफ्ट वाइट गरी तीन आकर्षक कलरहरुमा उपलब्ध छ यो एयर ब्राको मूल्य मात्र 4095 तर तपाईले यसलाई 30 मिनेट भित्र अर्डर गर्नु भए भने अझै अर्को दुईवटा एयर ब्रा सित्तैमा उपहार स्वरूप प्राप्त गर्नु हुनेछ त्यसैले ढिला नगर्नुस् तुरुन्तै फोन गरी आकर्षक र सेक्सी बडी बनाउने एयर ब्रा खरिद गरी एउटा आत्मविश्वासको आकर्षक अनुभूति प्राप्त गर्नुहोस् यो तीन कलरको एयर ब्राको मूल्य मात्र 4095 स्टक सीमित भएकोले चाँडै अर्डर गर्नुहोस् स्काई शॉप नेपाल अगर माता टेलीविजन तो पाई कुत्ते स्वाखा केस हरने तथा कपाल को सभी समस्याओं को समाधान आई पुगियो इरवा मार्टिन हेयर लोशन इरवा मार्टिन शत प्रतिशत प्राकृतिक जड़ी बूटी बाटा बनाईये को होना ले जिसको कुने पनी साइड इफेक्ट हो दे ना इरवा मार्टिन हेयर लोशन सभी उम्र का स्त्री पुरुष हर को लागी उपयुक्त अच्छा इरवा मार्टिन ले केस को जरा दिखी टुप्पो समा पोषण दिए रा कपाल को सभी समस्याएँ ला समाधान करे रा तपाईं को केस धरना दिखी रोक नु मात्रा होई ना स्वास्थ्य र आकर्षक पनी बनाऊँ छा इरवा मार्टिन पनी एमाज़ोन को घना जंगल मा पाईने एक अद्भुत जड़ी बूटी हो जसलाई बैगानिक तरीका ले प्रसोधन गरी तैयार गरीय को होना ले यो अत्यंते प्रभावकारी छा बाजार में आइले केस धरने समस्या को उपचार का नाम में सस्तो और नकली लोशन और उपनी आयरे का चन यस्ता नकली उत्पादन और देखी सावधान रहनु होला स्काई शॉप का सभी सामान हरु गारंटेड हुन्चन तेसरे ने इरवा मार्टिन पनी गारंटेड था तपाइले एक महीना में सही परिणाम पाउनु भएना बने तपाइ आफ्रो पैसा फिरता � दर्शक बिन नमस्ते आज हमी एसटीबी चैट में सोर और करीब हमी 50 मिनट सांगे रहने चाहूं और आज को एसटीबी चैट का हमरा पावना होने उनसे एसबी बर्मा वाइस प्रेसिडेंट होने उनसे वहां गांधी ग्लोबल फैमिली बाटा वहां आइले नेपाल आउने भाई कुछ और गांधी ग्लोबल फैमिली की हो और वहां को नेपाल आउने को � भन्ने कुरा में हमी साल साल का नगरी रखे कुछ और यो भंडा आगर ही उठा जब हमी गांधी को नाम आउ था जब हमी गांधी जी को नाम लें जो महात्मा गांधी को तो तीव्र उठा कुरा याद आऊं सब मलाई वहाँ को उठा कोटेशन सब माय लाइफ इज मे मैसेज जैसेरी वाली हिंदी में ची जैसेरी भाई ने चाहे मेरी जिंदगी ही मेरा संदेश है जैसे कि नेपाली में हमले मेरे जिंदगी नहीं मेरे संदेश हो भने रचिं वहाँ ले जैसेरी उटा अपने उटा मैसेज दिनों भाई को सा भारत को जनता का लाइफ मतलब ना भाई रहा यो संपूर्ण न्याय प्रेमी अथवा बानु जो शांति पूर्णता दिखाले आगाडी पड़चन वहाँ को लगी उटा महत्वपूर्ण मैसेज संदेश रहे कुछ आ रहे इसे बिसे में हमें आज कुराखाने करने का रखे कुछ हों गांधी ग्लोबल फैमिली का वाइस प्रेसिडेंट एसपी बर्मा रवां हमें वहाँ लाइमें स्वागत करते हों वेल and the Gandhi Global Family, the objective, the motive about Gandhi Global Family. So what exactly, could you please clarify, elaborate what exactly Gandhi Global Family is? Actually, uh, Gandhi Global Family, uh, this is an international organization. Uh, it promotes uh, international understanding and cooperation for world peace. And you know, uh, an uh, eminent Gandhian, uh, Dr. Nirmala Deshpande, uh, who floated this organization during 2005. Uh, she remained disciple of Mahatma Gandhi ji and Vinoba ji. And uh, according to him, uh, uh, he was, uh, she was telling to us that uh, Gandhi ji is relevant, not in India, but throughout world. And uh, his message uh, 
uh, should propagate everywhere in the world for restoration of peace. Not in, only in India, but in other parts of the world. Yeah. Like, uh, I think uh, you have uh, the Gandhi Global Family has branches in 31 countries worldwide. Yeah. So I think uh, you have established a branch in Nepal as well, very recently. Yeah. So what is the objective? Uh, actually, um, uh, uh, as I have already told you, that Gandhi Global Family is an international organization with headquarters at New Delhi. Uh, uh, sole uh, aim is to promote uh, uh, the ideology of uh, Mahatma Gandhi. Gandhi's philosophy, uh, uh, yeah, principles. Principles okay. for uh, restoration of world peace, actually. So, uh, uh, we have the mandate uh, to start uh, its branches uh, in other parts of the world also. So, we have branches in um, uh, Europe, various countries in Af Africa and in Sark countries. And uh, now, um, uh, already we have entered in 30 countries and um, uh, it was the wish of uh, Didi Nirma Deshpande. You know, um, Didi Nirma Deshpande started a unique uh, program in Nepal during uh, 2000 uh, through a local Gandhian uh, of Nepal, Shri Surya Busalji, uh, for strengthening of people-to-people -people contact uh, between the uh, India and uh, uh, Nepal. Basically, so, uh, that means the theme is to contact, theme of this uh, Gandhi Global Family is to is people to people contact. Yeah. Okay. So Nepal is the 31st country. Yeah. Very recently. Exactly. Day before okay. yesterday, we uh, launched. Uh, so you inaugurated. The yeah. So your basic major objective was to inaugurate the Nepal chapter. Yeah. Okay. So you have also Nepal India Mighty Hospital. Yeah. So what exactly? So I've heard that you have uh, provided 15 beds free. So this was the dream of uh, Didi Nirma Deshpande and uh, uh, I am happy that uh, um, uh, Shri Surya Busal, who is uh, heading Gandhi Global Family in Nepal, uh, has started uh, a unique um, uh, project uh, of establishment of uh, the uh, Nepal Bharat Maitri Hospital. And uh, uh, now, uh, day before yesterday, we were there, uh, the hospital is under construction. And uh, we have decided, me and uh, Surya Basalji, that we must uh, do some charity work also. So, uh, for Gandhi Global Family uh, Organization, uh, we have kept 15 beds uh, so that people, those who are uh, below poverty line, they don't afford uh, the costly that, uh, treatment, medical treatment. So, they will be given uh, free of cost treatment and beds uh, and other facilities also. As Gandhiji has said, you know, like the first principle, I, I just want to read this, yeah. this sentence. The first principle which guided all his thoughts and activities in the complete unity and integrity of body, mind and soul in the individual human being. Yeah. Does this really work like in the current situation, in the current political situation, context, in the modern world? No, uh, because uh, uh, we have seen uh, during current uh, affairs, that uh, the world and uh, uh, maximum humans, uh, maximum percentage of humans, uh, they have turned materialistic. So, uh, we should have trust on Almighty, on um, Him or uh, Herself and on um, and, uh, their neighborhood also. So, uh, uh, rightly Mahatma Gandhi has said uh, that uh, we should have perfect relationship between our mind and soul and uh, the people uh, around us. Yeah, when we talk about Mahatma Gandhi, we, we just go back, we get, you know, to those uh, movement, you know, when uh, Mahatma Gandhi spearheaded the independence movement in India. And yes, in 1947, India got, you know, like was independent. So he was talking about spiritual, uh, spiritualization of politics. So what this what does this mean, spiritualization of politics? And you know, in the current co uh, context, we can see you know arms, violence. You know, everywhere you can see violence only. People and different political parties raising arms. You know, suppose when we talk about Nepal, also we experience a decade-long armed conflict. So now, okay, uh, finally uh, we are under the peace process and we are in the transition at the moment. But when we talk about like spiritualization of politics. How does this uh, like uh, imply to the current uh, 
or political situation? How do you think this Im does it imply? Uh, you know, um, uh, we have uh, a relationship with Almighty. Human and uh, nature should have friendly relations, okay. actually. And uh, we must have the blessings of uh, the Almighty also. And a uh, uh, person should be God-fearing. And uh, it should apply to all sections of the society, whether they are politicians or um, uh, working in other fields. So we should, uh, that, uh, according to uh, the uh, uh, that, uh, principles laid down by Almighty, we should follow them. And uh, we should have uh, some uh, Lakshman Rekha also uh, for every sections of the society. Because uh, you know that uh, we should have some institutions to train the future politicians also. Um, uh, you know uh, some people, those who come uh, raw-handed in politics, uh, because of division of the society, the people board them and uh, some uh, fractured mandate is coming. Um, um, this is a, tre a trend is becoming uh, from, uh, not in uh, India, not in Nepal, uh, all over the world. Other parts of the world as yeah. well, unhealthy competition. Uh, yeah. So, yes. uh, uh, this um, uh, one party uh, that uh, uh, mandate should come and uh, one party should rule. And uh, that can uh, uh, take the decisions to implement the things in the welfare of the people in the respective countries. Okay, you talked about God, you know, um, Almighty God. So we should at least fear God. And I, I like, you know, just, just remember Gautam Buddha was born in Nepal and he got enlightenment in Buddha Gaya in India. So do you have something to say about it? Like, uh, uh, you are from Jammu Kashmir. Yeah. As you said, we, we are talking, you know, like you said, you have three, uh, you have relation with Nepal. What are those relationships? You know, um, uh, I have uh, three relations uh, with Nepal. Uh, one, Lord Buddha um, was born in Lumni, in, uh, in Nepal country, and uh, he got uh, enlightenment in Bodh Gaya in India. That is our first relation. And uh, number two relation is, uh, Mahatma Gandhi, uh, who became father of nation, uh, was born in India, but he followed the teaching of uh, Lord Buddha. Lord Buddha, exactly. Yeah. And number three is, I also belong to Himalayan region. So uh, three, uh, that, uh, uh, because of three relationships. Yeah, similarities, you yeah, can say, yeah, okay. Yeah. So I have come here with some hope that uh, the Gandhian ideology and uh, Lord Buddha's teachings uh, uh, will be made familiar among us the people uh, of both the countries because uh, uh, we people uh, because of uh, this uh, Lord Buddha and Mahatma Gandhi ji and Himalayan range uh, it becomes our responsibility we are peace loving people it becomes our responsibility now it be becomes our giant responsibility now uh, to lead the world for world peace. Okay, I'll come back to you again, Gandhiji. Selflessness, non-attachment, and non-violence. These were the three convictions of Gandhiji. Am yeah. I right? Yeah. So he was always, he always stuck to that, to his philosophy. He, he was never deterred from his, you know, like ideology. So was that the reason, like, India got independent? Because uh, he had the bill, actually. Okay. Uh, he commanded the um, uh, mind and souls of the uh, that uh, Indians. So, uh, but uh, you know, uh, nobody can conquer the souls and minds without any sacrifice towards the people. So he sacrificed everything. He was uh, that, uh, like a uh, family from a uh, royal family and he sacrificed everything. And um, then uh, people accepted his wisdom and followed him. So to become uh, that um, immortal, uh, you have to sacrifice. He was a true leader, yeah, genuine was. leader, yeah. father of the nation. For other, and for the people also. For the people, people for yes. the country. For the country and for the whole and of the world the entire now. region. Yeah, entire region and for the whole of the world because during 2007, the whole UNO in one verdict, mm -hmm. they have decided uh, to celebrate the birth uh, anniversary uh, of um, the Mahatma Gandhi as uh, International Nonviolence Day. So throughout the world. That's wonderful. It, yeah. And uh, uh, the most uh, uh, that, uh, powerful person uh, on the earth is uh, uh, that uh, U.S. President uh, Barack Obama. But he said when he visited India, 
He said, the real hero of my life is Mahatma Gandhi. Mahatma Gandhi. I am here as president of US because of Mahatma Gandhi. So um, he has recently told uh, to the media that um, I will secure or I will go to secure the second tenureship as president of US and I will um, uh, take the uh, ideology of Mahatma Gandhi uh, with me also uh, and I will take it among us the people and I will ask the people to vote for me. And um, uh, in um, that Germany, uh, I have read in newspaper the, uh, the version of the president of Germany. He said uh, that uh, uh, the, uh, I am facing a lot of unrest among us, the citizens of uh, Germany. The time has come to eradicate their uh, restlessness, um, but uh, I have to implement through the ideology of uh, Mahatma Gandhi. That was great. Yeah. Dharmak Chetra, Kuruk Chetra, Shamaveda, Youth Sava, Mamaka, Pandavas, Chaivaki, Makurbata, Sanjaya. I think this was what uh, Gandhi used to recite daily, no? Bhagavad Gita. Bhagavad Gita. Yeah. He, he was uh, that, uh, the um, uh, well in command on uh, Bhagavad Gita, Quran, okay. Bible. Then um, uh, he was uh, that, uh, following the path, of, uh, path shown by Lord Buddha, Mahavira. No violence. No violence, no. Non-violent word uh, he has taken uh, that, uh, from Buddha, Lord Buddha. Exactly. Yeah. Peace word. Simplicity. Yeah, simplicity, yes. Sacrifice. Despite the fact that he, he was educated in yeah. Great he, Britain. Yeah, and he was true secular person because uh, he was staunch Hindu, uh, but uh, he had a respect for all the religions because he read the holy books of all the religions. So like is it possible to